Hey y'all, Dennis Marmy here. I look after strategic accounts with Get Abstract and want to share this quick video with you that's going to end with kind of a cool story. Um, I view Get Abstract as having a very specific mission, purpose, and meaning for what we do for our clients. Um, kind of a cool quote, the purpose of life is a life of purpose with, uh, with Robert Byrne, who's a best-selling author, but he's also a, a great pool player. Um, but I see Get Abstract as helping our clients advance their careers, have better conversations, make better decisions, and even connect more closely with one another with our compressed knowledge solution. Um, so I encourage you to read as many abstracts as you can, but at least three a week. So what I find too is that inspiration is found at the least expected moments. So that brings me to my story. Um, every year we get together as a company to talk about several things, um, but when we kick off the year, one of the topics of discussion is what's coming up for the next year, for what's, you know, what's coming through 2018. So one of the sessions was introducing a brand new collection that we have that we're releasing called Compressed Science and Technology. And the editorial team did a great job putting the, the session together. They printed out several um, sample abstracts. And the first summary, the abstract that I picked up first, reminded me of a conversation that I just had with with my doctor. Um, so let me talk a little bit about that. I went, I started boxing and Saturday night I had a bout and Monday I had a doctor's appointment, which was totally unrelated. It was my annual checkup. But as I'm talking with my doctor, he diagnosed me as having concussion symptoms and he strongly encouraged me to stop boxing and he said the reason I'm asking you to stop is because when you get older this you know head impact can have long-term effects and it could cause like a locked-in syndrome um, that will have you maybe trapped in your your own body and this is what this is what sort of you know kind of scared me um, he was talking about how you wouldn't be able to communicate and express yourself. So that's kind of the setting. So now let's go back to the session, learning about compressed science and technology. The team had shared a few abstracts. I picked one up, read the abstract, and it was about a study that was being done with, by, with individuals, with patients that had locked in syndrome. And what they did, they took a like a headpiece that had electrodes in it that was able to measure brain activity that was enabling these patients to, to communicate with a yes or no answer. So they asked all of the patients, are you happy? And every one of them said yes. So that kind of made me feel a bit more comfortable about my situation. Um, so now I'm thinking about going back to boxing, at least I'm back into training. But I wanted to share that with you because I think it's important that the inspiration that Get Abstract provides to folks that use it, myself and, and our clients included, it really does come at the most unexpected moments. And it could be something completely unrelated to work. It might be you know, a personal experience. So I encourage you to read Get Abstract as often as you can. And hopefully you find those, those moments of inspiration, or I call them magic moments, but I, it, it really happens quite a bit with Get Abstract that you know helps in so many different ways. That's my story. I thank you so so much for listening. Hope you got some value from this and have a great day.